like it, it's Liam. Look, what do you, what do you think of what's happening with with Pep and this team and what he's what he's doing? Like at Napoli, top of Serie A, they were taught. I was reading some stuff today. They're talking about their team, the Napoli team, playing the sort of football that they played when Maradona was there. You know that they, it's they're, they're playing great football and they get torn asunder. I think the Italian league is a good bit behind the Premier League, Dara. You know, I think Juventus have flown the flag for the Italian league for some years now, but apart from them, there's not really been much. And Napoli are making a go of it this season. But when you, when you compare the like for like, uh, he really does believe, as Eamon says, that no matter how many you score, we're going to score. And it's great to see. It's great to watch. Um, and some of the forward players they have, Aguero, as Eamon mentioned, De Bruyne this year has been absolutely magnificent. Roll on the, the Champions League, definite candidates. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. right, now, like, you know, it's the first time, like, you know, you, you know, Napoli, you've played there. It's the first time that they've ever conceded four goals at home in Europe. Like, we were talking about earlier on about being easy to score goals in the Premier League. Well, it's not easy <coughs> to score them against top Italian teams. I think it was teams. a must win game for Napoli, Dara. And, you know, if you come in and throw everything forward yeah. and you get hit on the break by the calibre of players, you saw Sanya race away there and Aguero pick it up after he, uh, he was tackled. If you, if you commit too many men forward against the City team, they'll destroy you. Yeah, it was great football and a great uh, performance from City as they go through to the last 16.